Hi everyone, this is Tara from the Rye Free Reading Room, and today I'm going to show you Overdrive and Libby, which are both great ways to download ebooks and audiobooks for free with your library card, and there are no late fees. So Overdrive and Libby are actually the same product, just different ways to use that product. Think of it kind of as if you went to a store and to buy something, or if you went to that store's website to buy that same product, at the end of the day, you're still shopping the same store and getting the same product. You just had a different experience and to get that product. That's how Overdrive and Libby are. You're going to be able to get the same ebooks and audiobooks. You're just going to access them in a slightly different way. So to start off, I'm going to show you how to get to Overdrive. You can go to Rye Library's website, click on online services, go to ebooks, music, and film, and click on the Overdrive link. You can also go to westchesterlibraries.org Go to listen, read, and watch, and again, click on the Overdrive link. And that will bring you to Overdrive's website, which you can access through any web browser. If you want to get Libby, it is going to have to be an app. So you can use any device that has an App Store, Google Play, or if you have Windows 10, you can get Libby as an app through that. Overdrive is also available as an app um, in the same places. So. The only difference is kind of the look. Um, Libby has a you know a little more of a fun vibe to it, but you're going to be able to find the same things. Um, and really, it's just your preference as to which you enjoy using better. So to get an account, you would click sign in if you're going to the website um, through the westchester.overdrive.com link. Enter your library card number and PIN, and you'll be in. If you're using the app and it asks you for your library, just make sure you click on Westchester Library System, not a specific library. Um, once you're in, you can go through um, any books that say available. Will you can borrow right away? Um, if it says waitlist, you will have to um, wait a little bit, but you can add yourself to the waitlist. Now, these books, even though they are online, they are treated like physical items almost. So if there are 10 items available, that means 10 people can check them out and only one item can go to one person. Similar, if a library had three copies of a book on its shelf, only three people can borrow one copy each. So these items do work like that. So if all these people have um, a book that you want checked out, just put yourself on the wait list and you'll be notified when you are able to listen or read that book. Now, if you go to your settings, you can um, change your default lending period between seven and 14 days for ebooks and audiobooks. Videos have a choice of three, five, or seven days. Um, you can also see your different loans, your holds, all those different things. Um, and that's pretty much the basis for that. If you need any help, there is a great help page. Um, through Overdrive down at the bottom. If you need help, there's videos, support, how to get it on different devices. And remember, you can always come to the library. Um, you can message us, email us, give us a call, and we'll help you if you need any help with it. Um, but other than that, happy reading, happy listening, and have a great day.